Hey guys, so y'all know I have issues, right? Sewing so lasted a week and a day. Uh, yeah, uh, I just got tired of it, and since I've been um, hitting the gym pretty hard uh, last for the last week or so, um, I couldn't get into my hair and wash it like I wanted to. So yeah, pause on the braid, pause on the um, sewing for a little bit. Um, what I have in my hair today is Lejay, and I just have my sides out right here. But that is not what this video is about. This video is about the Shea Moisture Organic Coconut and Hibiscus Curl and Styling Milk. Okay, so y'all know my history with Shea Moisture, right? The deep tr treatment mask was crap. The, um, what else? The curl enhancing smoothie which I guess is the sister to this was really really big pieces of crap so um, me and Shea Moisture are too fond of each other okay but um, I decided to give this one a try um, I bought it the same time I bought all the rest of them so um, yeah and I've actually used this a lot um, it's to like right here so I've used a good amount of it and to my surprise, I actually like this stuff. Okay, so the ingredients. There are a lot of them, so I'll give you the first five. Um, deionized water, um, shea butter, coconut oil, sugar starch, and silk protein. Okay, and I'll put the rest of them down at the bottom. But, okay, so it smells like all the rest of the coconut hibiscus line. Ah, and I got out my nose. <laughs> it's like lotion my face okay smells like the rest of them very sweet very sugary very yummy I like the way it smells okay um and I am thinking uh from what I read everywhere this is a lighter version of the curly Henson smoothie but um overall I really like this um it's I used it I, do, I don't like it as a leave-in on wet hair I do not like it on wet hair at all. Um, for, for me, it takes forever to kind of um, disappear when I put it on my wet hair. So yeah, not wet hair for me. But um, this is probably one of the best refreshers I've used for like twist outs or whatever. Because um, y'all know I have a TWA, so if I'm doing a twist out, I'm not retwisting my hair to go to sleep in big twists because my big twists won't come out right because my hair isn't long enough to do kind of y'all get what I'm saying anyways so um yeah so as far as refresher I just get this and kind of wake my hair up with it which is of course what a refresher does so I really like this for that um and just to do twists with um like say like I'm gonna have to retwist the front of this tonight um before I go work out so what I'll do is just use a little bit of this and just put it on my hair as a moisturizer and retwist with it so overall I like this product um as a as something if I would buy it again I would buy it again um but it would have to be in a Target near me for me to buy it again. Um, no Targets here in San Diego sell. Um, Shea Moisture showed that I'd have to drive up to L.A. And I'm not driving up to L.A. for Shea Moisture. So um, if a Target here or when I go back home to Texas to visit or something carries it, then hey, I'll pick it up. I mean, it was, what, 10 bucks or something for 8 ounces of product, which... It's fine, I guess. And I've had it for months. I got it when I first came to California, so I've had it for about four months. So, pretty good shelf life for me. Oh, well, I have a lot of stuff, so. But, um, but yeah, so I would buy it again. It has to be on the ground. Um, if you're looking for a lighter alternative to the Curly Enhancing Smoothie, here you go. Um, it doesn't do anything for enhancing curls, defining curls. It has no hold. It is a moisturizer in the true sense of the, well, yeah, it's water-based. So it's a moisturizer in the true sense of the word or whatever. But hey, if you have 10 bucks to spare looking for something that is mostly natural, mostly natural, um, then hey, give it a try. Good stuff. Worth the money. 
So yeah, so Shea Moisture Curling Hansing, <laughs> Curling Hansing, Curl and Style Milk. Um, give it a try and let me know what you think of it. Alright guys, I'll talk to you later. Bye.